Hello, good morning, third grade. It's so nice to see you. So I know I haven't done a formal video like this in a while for you, but we're probably going to do music classes like this. So if you don't remember me, my name is Mrs. Smith. Remember, I'm you, I am your new music teacher this year. So like I said, it's nice to see all of you again. I'm really happy that we are doing music class here on Monday. We're going to be doing a lot of fun things. We're going to be reviewing some of the rhythms that you may have come across during second grade. You're going to be learning a new song, and then you're going to have a nice little Just Dance video to do. So you probably see I have a nice little bat shirt on. Halloween is my favorite holiday, so you'll probably see me in the upcoming videos wearing a lot of Halloween stuff because that's my favorite holiday. So I'm going to share my screen with you just so you can see some of the things that you are going to be doing today. You should be seeing this. So it says, welcome back to music third grade. I'll always have what we're doing today. So rhythm review, you'll see that's me. Nice little bit moji. You're going to be having a new song. And then at the end, I'll show you how to get to your Just Dance video. So. Can you raise your hand if you know what this note is called? You may have encountered this last year in second grade. And just raise your hand if you know what this one is called. Go ahead and say it to the camera. Yeah, so if you said ta, that is correct. So another name for ta is a quarter note. And a quarter note gets one sound or one. And a quarter note fits into one beat. So... If you have a ta, can you go ahead and snap after me? Can you please say ta, ta, ta? Ta, 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 ta. Perfect. And go ahead and raise your hand if you know what this note is called. Go ahead and say it to the camera. It is, if you said t, t, that is correct. Now, TT, just like you can see here, it has two circles at the bottom. We call those note heads. A TT has two note heads because a TT has two sounds in it. Can you please clap and say TT? Good, clap after me. Can you please say TT, 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 TA? Good, and don't forget that snap at the end. I'm gonna give you some patterns. Please speak them after me. TT, TA. T ta. Ta ta t ta. Good. And if you're having trouble snapping, because I really didn't know how to snap until a couple years ago, you can go ahead and do the crab. So if you can't snap, no problemo. Just go ahead and crab. Can you please clap after me and say t t ta t t ta? Perfect. Nice job, boys and girls. All right, raise your hand if you know what this note is called. Say it to the camera. If you said rest or sh or a silent or silent note, you would be absolutely correct. So a rest, to me, it sort of looks like a Harry Potter lightning bolt, the um, little scar that Harry had on his forehead. So a quarter rest or rest is an entire beat of silence. Now we can show rests in the music room by doing that. So can you please echo the patterns after me? Perfect, echo the patterns after me. I'm going to include the rest, T, T, and ta. My turn first, T, T, ta. T, T, ta. Ta, ta. T, 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 ta. Perfect. All right, boys and girls, I want you to try this one on your own. Now remember the taws are the snaps or the crab and the TTs are clapping. Try it by yourself. One, two, ready and go. One more time. Ta goes first. Ta. One more time with me and go. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta. 
Nice job, third grade. All right, try this one by yourself. Ta goes first. One, two, ready, go. Ta. Second time, by yourself. Ta. Third time with me, and here we go. Ta, ti, ti, ta, ta. Nice job, boys and girls. All right, last one. Try it by yourself. One, two, and ta goes first. Second time, don't forget to snap. Third time with me, and here we go. Ta, ta, ta. Nice job, everybody. All right, so I have a song for you. I'm going to go back up to the top. So it is a new song. You may, I'm thinking you probably have not heard it before, but you have a new song. I want you to listen for what state the girl in the song is from. So listen for what state you hear. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry, Alabama girl. I'll show you how, how. I'll show you how, how. I'll show you how, how, Alabama girl. Raise your hand if you know what state you heard in the song. If you said Alabama, you are correct. All right, so this song has four parts to it. I want you to listen to the whole thing and listen for what kind of candy comes at the end of the song. While you are listening, you can go. So go ahead and keep this pattern going. Listen for what kind of candy is at the end of the song. Listen, please. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry, Alabama gal. You don't know how, how. You don't know how, how. You don't know how, how, Alabama gal. I'll show you how, how. I'll show you how, how. I'll show you how, how, Alabama gal. Ain't I rock candy? Ain't I rock candy? Ain't I rock candy? I love them, my gal. Raise your hand if you heard the type of candy that comes at the end of the song. Good. If you said rock candy, you are correct. All right, so go ahead and read along with the song. I'm going to sing it for you one more time. Follow along with the words, please. Come through now, hurry, come through now, hurry, come through now, hurry, Alabama gal. You don't know how, how, you don't know how, how, you don't know how, how, Alabama gal. I'll show you how, how, I'll show you how, how, I'll show you how, how, Alabama gal. Ain't I rock candy? Ain't I rock candy? Ain't I rock candy, Alabama girl? Good. So can you raise your hand if all four of the sections of the song sound the same? Note-wise. We obviously know that the lyrics are different, but raise your hand if the melody sounds exactly the same. If you said, if your hand is raised, you would be correct. So note for note, each four parts of the song are exactly the same. I would like you to sing after me. My turn first, please. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry, Alabama gal. Come through. Good. Listen longer, please. I'm going to sing that whole section. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry, Alabama gal. Come through now, hurry. Good. Pull out your hands or your fingers. Can you clap the way the words go and sing it after me? My turn first. Come through now, hurry. Come through now, hurry. 
come through, no hurry. I'm a panda girl. Nice job. All right, so we're gonna travel over to the piano. I would like you to think in your head the lyrics of the song while you hear it on the piano. So you're going to think the words in your song. Sorry, think the words in your brain while you hear it on the piano. Second part, think it go. Third part, whoops, and here you go. Fourth part, think it go. So I'm going to sing the whole song for you. There will be a slight pause in between each section just because I need to hit my mouse and change the slides. Listen to the whole thing. I'm going to sing the whole thing first, then you sing it the whole thing after me. My turn first, and here we go. Come through, no hurry. Come through, no hurry. Come through, no hurry. I'm a girl. You don't know how. All right, moment of truth. So we have come through no hurry. You don't know how, how. I'll show you how, how. Ain't I rock candy? You were going to try the whole thing by yourself. I think you can do it. You guys got this. Hold you in a little bit closer. This way I don't have to reach as far to hit the mouse. All right. Here's your little intro. You sing whenever I go. Ready, go. Ready, go. How'd you do? Give me a thumbs up if you got all the words. Give me a wiggly thumb if you got most of them. You all did better than a thumbs down, so we're not even going to do that. So that is, so that song is called Alabama Gal, and it'll be coming back into our music classes every single week. So before you leave, I'm going to show you how to get to your Just Dance video. So there is a link that's going to be posted with your assignment. That link is going to look like this. When you click the link in your assignment, you'll be taken to a YouTube page. That YouTube page, after you hear the possible ad that's gonna come up before the video, you can skip that ad. We take it to a Just Dance page that looks like this. Your job is to go along with the movements that are shown in the video. So you're going to be dancing along with Pharrell Williams' song, Happy. And whenever you are done with the Just Dance video, I would like you to complete the Google form as an assessment of some of the rhythms and some parts of the song. So full thing for this week. Watch the entire video that I made dance with the video, complete the Google form. Those are your three things for this week in music. So I'm going to go back here. I'm going to stop presenting. So watch the video, participate in the video that I made, dance with the Just Dance video, complete the Google form. 
Again, third grade, those are the only three things that you have to do for me. So I hope you enjoyed our time together. Like I said, I'm going to be making more videos like this as the weeks go on. This way you can see more my face more and this way you can participate in some of the, the songs and the activities that we would actually do in the music room. So I hope everybody has a marvelous Monday and like reach out to me through email. If you have any questions, I will be sure to post my email address just in case you have any questions and I can't wait to see everybody next week. All right, third grade, have a good day.